Yeah. Hello, um, uh, my name is Daniel van der Velde. Next to me is Vinka Kruk, uh, Meddenhaven from Amsterdam. And in the graphic design world, we've created uh, a kind of political campaign uh, and three dimensional sketchbook about WikiLeaks, the media organization and whistleblower website. So, Vinka, what, what do you think is the most important element of this whole installation? Um, well, we created a number of different works in this installation, among which there are the, um, a series of posters which are behind us. Um, I think um, what is an important recurring theme in what we've tried to kind of explore visually is the idea of transparency. Um, what WikiLeaks promotes um, uh, and is kind of at the core of, uh, uh, of what they are about. So we have translated the idea of transparency into um, um, in, into like a, a visual uh, representation of that. So behind us on the poster, what you see is um, um, a number of slogans on the, on the posters. One saying "since radical transparency," the other one saying "transparent camouflage." Um, and over these texts, you see kind of a transparent layer of uh, um, of ink, um, which which shows only partly the, the text underneath. We also created um, a transparent protest banner, which is um, a, um, a banner you can, or a flag you can use in protest, but it's made of complete transparent material. So if you want to protest today, you, you, you have to protest with your own transparency, in a way. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So for us it's important to use an exhibition like uh, Graphic Design Worlds to actually create new work and to uh, so actually sketch, you know, and um, so not to show a portfolio, but to really uh, to create something new. And um, I'm very glad to get opportunities like this to actually explore, you know, nav new avenues for our work. Um, a lot of our work also takes place in uh, digital, but here everything is very fit physical, everything is very present. So um, this is an important uh, stage for us in the development of the WikiLeaks project, and we explore that further uh, coming months. That's two minutes? Almost, I think.